Well, as I get my eyeglasses cleaned, I decided to uh, add something to the uh, cowboy that I hadn't thought of until this weekend when I was watch watching an old movie, John Wayne movie called The Cowboys. I forgot to put a la lariat on his uh, saddle. And uh, so I'm going to do that right now. Actually, I was thinking of putting it in his hand. I don't know. i got to figure out what I'm going to do. And i got to figure out how I'm going to make this uh, lariat look like a lariat. Anyway, I'm going to be right back. Time to play with some clay. I've come up with several alternative titles for this clay. Hop, skip, and a jump. Or There Goes Dinner. Or Prairie Surprise. Or Hair Here and Hair Gone. Now, the official scientific name for a jackrabbit is a hair. And that's why I put that in there. I'm not sure that would work out. But those are some alternative titles I've come up with. I'm not certain I'm going to be doing that. Actually, my uh, favorite out of those uh, four t possible titles, I like uh, Prairie Surprise the best because it's short. And it says everything you need to have. Okay, I'm going to start rolling clay. That will be the uh, lariat and uh, I'm going to see if I can figure out a way of putting some kind of texture in it to make it look like rope. Okay, I've got uh, the rope for the lariat made. I just got to The thing is I can't have the rope with any space between it because if they make a mold of this it's got to uh be castable Now, I've seen pictures of uh, cowboy ropes or lariats hanging real loose. This is the hondo here. It's wrapped around. It actually, when they unraveled the, the rope, they come out with a uh, lariat already ready to go. I really hate doing this, but all that work on those fingers. But I want to have it in his hand. Let's see, I got to lift it up a little bit more. Yeah, I thought of this yesterday morning while I was laying in bed. I sometimes get my best ideas early in the morning. I've got to uh, now make all that work out. Well, this is actually looking pretty good. It's just indicating a wound rope. 
And that's all you really need. If they have to fabricate a lariat and weld it or solder it on, it costs. If they just have to make a mold of the horse, which includes the uh, lariat, in the mold, then it doesn't cost you anything extra. Okay, the end of the lariat would have a that kind of look to it. Okay, I've got to increase the back of his hand now. Okay, I'm going to put a little Ronson all on here to take down the roughness of uh, my working the texture of the uh, lariat. Okay, I'm going to start doing the hair on the cowboy. Okay, I'm just going to hit it with some Ronsonol again to just take down any rough areas. I think it turned out pretty good. All right, I've uh, dug a trench in the back of his neck, the horse's neck. And that's where I'm going to put the mane. And uh, we'll see how this turns out. I, it's going to make or break this piece. The uh, design and the flow of the mane of the horse. And that's something i got to think about. I don't want to get carried away with the front part of the main. I've never tried this kind of mane before. This is the first try. Kind of like the way it's working out because it'll make it easy for them to make a cast of it. They may have to cut that part off of the mane. In fact, more than likely they will. I don't know if it'll 
have to be changed because I'm going to take it to the foundry and uh, get them to give me a new bit on it with the main and everything on it. And uh, we'll see what happens. Okay, I'm gonna just brush on some Ronsonol to take down the rough. And uh, I'll let this sit overnight and see what I feel like tomorrow. This went out, went pretty good, I think. I think it turned out pretty good the way it did. And, uh, I had to do something dramatic on that other side with the main because there's so little going on on that side other than this side. And so I had to decide what, how to do that uh, dramatically on both sides. And I think I got it. I think I got it. I don't know. And, uh, happy the way it turned out well, I like the way his hair turned out and I like the way the uh, mane on the horse turned out too I still have the bat jackrabbit to work on and uh, put on to the uh, base but first I got to do the uh, tail so that's the way it's going today I like uh, the lariat. It really adds to it. I'm going to have to remind myself to work on that hand tomorrow as well. All right, everybody. That's it. By the way, let me know what you think of my four titles that I gave at the beginning of the video. And I'd appreciate your input. All right. Good night, everybody. See you next time. If you like this video, please like and subscribe to my channel. It really would help me. Also, check out the link below this video. It will take you to a review of my nine instructional videos that could be very helpful to you if you're thinking of sculpting. Good night, everybody.